Hey, this is Iman, that Philly wholesaler chick. Uh, I decided to uh, record this video um, before I lost the idea. The idea went out in my head. I happen to be searching, doing a search in Google on a keyword of mine that, um, that I submitted a video under. And then in the process of doing that search, I happened to come across some other keywords. And I saw uh, find a cash buyers. As you can see here at the top of uh, the search box, and um, when I uh, clicked the link for that because I saw related searches, that's where I found it. Um, I happened to see these two videos that showed up. One, uh, the one video that um, is here is uh, by Steph Davis of Flip This Wholesaler. That's her YouTube YouTube channel, and by the way, she has excellent uh, videos on wholesaling, so um, you definitely can't go wrong there. So. Anyway, uh, as I was listening to the video, I, an idea came to me. I've done this hundreds of times by this point, where I what I typically do is if I'm out cruising for cash, um, or you know I'm getting leads from other places, I'll the first thing I'll do is I'll type the address into Google because I've had the experience where I've mailed out and I've later come to find out that it was already listed on MLS. So when I when I Google search an address if it's in the MLS on the MLS it'll show up in the search engines so anyway um, you can type I'm just using it as an example type the address in and this is the site that I often see come up which is citydata.com now what I'm going to be discussing is specific to Philadelphia um, I don't know how you would search for property records in your area but anyway this site this site typically comes up and here it'll give you information about that block that you're searching on and I see who owns this first property that comes up right and I also see the sale price is two thousand nine hundred dollars and that's a good indication that that is a cash buyer that they're an, uh, an investor so I, what you could do you know and this is all about how uh, to find cash buyers here in Philadelphia I would then go to the BRT uh, which then brings you, you know, this is where it brings you, uh, brt.com or brt.org. I don't remember specifically. I just do it so much that I don't even really remember the address. I would then input that information. I would input the address in. We know who this, who the owner is, but, you know, you can get the owner's address. And what I would then do is, you know, you can do one of two things. You can um, either... Um, take that address information of the owner and mail them um, either a postcard or a letter to let them know that hey I buy you know I, I noticed that you you know you have a property in this area I buy properties in this area and I was you know wondering whether you would be interested in buying more property or uh, the other way which I highly suggest is to get a phone number um, you know phone contact information and uh, I would you know highly suggest investing any skip trace service to do that um, or and like I said there are free resources but my experience has been with the free re resources that I am aware of Zaba search um, you know 411 uh, whitepages.com a lot of times what I have found is that you know these investors they don't list their phone numbers because for whatever reason they just don't list them so I would you know highly recommend um, investing in a skip trace service to uh, ascertain that information and then you know again um, you know explain to them call them up and let them know that you buy you know you saw that they have property in that area you were wondering if they would be interested in buying more property and like I said with the skip trace service I'm also able I'm able to see with that property owner how many properties they own. So um, I would highly recommend the, the specific one that I use. I don't know about other skip trace services, but the one that I use, I can see every last prop, every bit of every last property, or I don't even know if that sounds right, but every single property rather that they that that person owns. So again, hopefully this is helpful to you. Um, and uh, hopefully you can it'll assist you in how to find cash buyers here in Philadelphia. I'll see you in the next video.
Take 